Hey guys, and welcome to another Obsidian Dom tutorial. This one is a remake of how to install my brushes because, well, my old one wasn't even a video and it was so old that it was, I'm pretty sure Photoshop CS. Anyway, yes, it's outdated and so I'm redoing it. So here we are on my website. If you wanna find brushes that you can download, go to obsidiandawn.com. You will find tons and tons to your liking. I'm gonna look for, let's see, I'm gonna look in people and we will use, I will use my eyelash brushes because those are my, really my most popular set by far. <laughs> uh, this gives you a preview of what the brushes look like applied to an image in this case, obviously. You're gonna download it by clicking here. It's gonna let you know that you need to either A, credit us publicly or B, purchase a license. Now I'm on a Mac, so this is gonna be a little bit different for those of you that are a Windows user, but same basic idea. Um, on a Mac, you go into your downloads folder. Here it is, eyelashes. This right here is the terms of use. This explains to you how you may and may not use my brushes for free or under what circumstances you may need to buy a license. The file right here, this one, the ABR file, that is the brushes. Some people, however, make the mistake of just double clicking on them to try to open them, and that doesn't work. What you need to do is put it in the correct place on your computer, and then it will just be there in Photoshop the next time that you open it. Notice I said the next time that you open it. If you have Photoshop open like I do right now, you're gonna have to close it and reopen it. So the correct place on your computer is in your applications folder, if you are on a Mac, and then Adobe Photoshop, presets, and brushes. You can create folders within this folder and they will all show up, or you can just put them right here in the brushes folder. I like to organize all my brushes together. So this is all of Obsidian Dawn's brushes right here in this folder. I'm just gonna drag this right up there. Now that this ABR file is in my brushes folder, the next time I open Photoshop, they will be ready to use. And I will show you how to do that in just a second. First, for all of you Windows users, it's gonna be very similar. You're gonna look in your program files directory and then Adobe, and then the same thing, Adobe Photoshop, presets, and brushes. And then drag the file right into there and you're good to go. So then you're gonna to wanna to go into Photoshop. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is hit the B button or click on this icon right here that looks like a paintbrush. It brings up the brush tool. And then up here in your top menu, See this little circle right here? That's my currently selected brush. It's a thumbnail of it. But I'm gonna to wanna to click on this tiny arrow to the right of it, and it's gonna bring up this menu. And here you're gonna see a collapsible menu of brushes and uncollapsible. These are your different sets that you have preloaded currently in Photoshop. You can always right click on them and delete them because it won't delete them from your computer. It will only remove them from this listing right here. You can always go back in and reload them up. So have no fear. To preload a new brush set, you're gonna to wanna to click on this icon, the gear. And then once you have that file in the correct folder in your presets brushes folder, it will show up right here in this long <laughs> list that I have because I have all of my brushes in that folder. So this is all of Obsidian Dawn's brushes right here. Lots of them. I am going to look for my lashes because those are the ones that I downloaded for this tutorial. It's going to ask you if you want to restore that brush preset. Yes, I do. And now voila, there it is. You can hit the arrow next to it to open it. This particular brush set, I have different eyelashes one for left, one for right, so that you can add them to eyes. For this tutorial, I'm just showing you how to install and the very basics of how to use brushes. So you see that I already have a canvas open to apply this to. Once you do, and once you select your brush, when you place the mouse over the canvas with that brush selected, it's gonna show you an outline of what that brush is gonna look like. This way, you can see what the size and orientation of the brush is before you use it. So if this is too big, you can use the brackets Left bracket makes it smaller, right bracket makes it larger. 
So the next step is going to be to choose your color. I'm going to do it in black and then just click and you have eyelashes. Keep in mind that if you're using one of my brush sets that scatters, you're going to maybe want to click and drag, but those are some more advanced controls and options that I get into in other tutorials. Same thing for a lower eyelash, lower, lower left. I need to make it a little bit smaller, not too small. If you need to rotate it, the right and left arrows will do that. And that will help you to fit it to the eye a little bit better. There we go. Imagine yourself an eye right in the center there. I hope that this clarifies how to download and install and use my brushes. Be sure to check out my other tutorials because I have ones that explain how scatter brushes work, how to make your own brushes scatter, and use all the different brush options. And I will be coming out with more soon. So be sure to subscribe here to me on YouTube and you can sign up for my newsletter on Obsidian Dawn right here in the lower right of all of the pages of my website and you will get a free brush set. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy. Now go back to my website and check out my selection.